Welcome back to Let's Play Stitch 626. We have a nice soldier waiting for us in the corner, but before that, we're gonna have our fun here. I guess they expect us to use the jetpack to get around here. Not quite sure. This guy is a nuisance. Just like all these other guys around here. Guns. Back off. Oh, okay, that, that works too, I guess. I was expecting the camera to go outside the place. Interesting. Yes, very impressive. Interesting to see that the skybox is actually space. We're actually at the end of the level. Oh, we could have basically just ended the last episode here. With this level being complete. Oh well. What is with those little dudes? Get back off. It looks like a little DNA bit though when I see him out of the corner of my eye. Anyway, so is that everything for this level then? It looks like it is. Ah, oh, I missed something. Darn it! Alright, well how well did we do? I missed one, of course. I don't know how I missed two reels. I'm surprised by that, actually. Oh well. Okay. Boss! Needed to power teleporters to the military ship. I want these meddling soldiers out of my lab. What? What is he doing? He's putting DNA in the mutator. My 626, you are so great. Look, I make a DNA enhancement for my finest creation. Oh, I'm sick of it. I'm sick of it. Well, everything's about to change. We'll see how Jemba feels about you now that I have used that DNA on myself. <laughs> now we settle this. Well, you've lost your ability to speak coherently, I guess. So there's that going for you. What? Why did I come here with only one gun? Curiosity. Nothing. Okay. So what does one do? One crawls, it looks like. Alright, so I'm gonna, this is going to be some weird platforming, I think. So you're going to need to stop doing that. First of all, so my camera does not feel optimized for going left right now. Uh, so I'm gonna have to try to do platforming, some pretty tight platforming too, by this game's standards. You're kidding me! I actually have to run up there while I'm. Man, because this game, you move really quickly in this game. So this, by this game standards, that's like really tight platforming. Just because in this game you run so quickly. So that's actually pretty tough to pull off. Not quite sure what the idea is behind me. Ugh. Trying to. Trying to run up here. What am I doing down here? What am I trying to do right now, actually? It's not clear to me what my actual goal is right now. Am I trying to shoot something that's on the, uh... It looks like that thing became vulnerable for a second. But right now it's not. 
He's stuck somewhere, it looks like. So I can hang out here for a moment. So I just... It's gonna bear itself again. I shoot it, drop down. I just have to do it one more time. Probably he's gonna bug me while I'm up here. And it looks like I need to survive that. Also, I'd literally just respawn if I die. That's easy. Okay. Very forgiving game. Which we already knew, but not even having to redo a boss fight is kind of crazy. Although, having to platformer this guy attacking you is not especially nice. So it seems like I have to just, just like stand around up here with him attacking me. Waiting for this thing to bear itself. Which is a little weird. I'm not misunderstanding it. Okay, so now it looks like... We have these electric things that I don't want to be touching. But I'm guessing I want him to be touching. That's really how it goes. I've created a hazard, so now I want him to be touching a hazard, I guess? I don't think I can pick him up. I cannot pick him up. But he doesn't go past me. If I, if I jump or anything like that. So I don't see a way to get him to move into the shocks. It can hurt me. He's not gonna come here. Use the walls, six to six. I get that, but I need him to go to the walls, don't I? He's not doing that. He's not going... If I dodge, he doesn't go past or anything. There we go. That's strangely difficult to pull off. Alright, well he's spin dashing into me. But he doesn't go much further. than you when you do that. He hasn't missed by much. Which makes it a lot harder. It's also not clear how big the hitbox is for these freaking electric walls. Darn it. Dude. I need to be far enough away from him to actually use his rolling attack. Okay. Dude. Okay. Come on. This might be... Well, that wasn't the most exciting of fights. Well, that's 61 dealt with, I guess. Not really sure what the main conflict is anymore. Since we dealt with that pretty fine. Drumba. Yeah, I guess we're just not worried about him anymore. Oh, actually, we get a cutscene. Forgot about that since we're starting off a new area. So, let's... Mm, I don't want to end up this episode earlier or anything, but... I invite don't, we're gonna end up just jumping into this level and then cutting it off right at the very beginning. But in any case, we can still watch this cutscene. It's a lot lighter in here now. Jumper, I've finally caught up with you. Oh, and how convenient. Your genetic experiment is here as well. You're both under arrest. So I guess Stitch has some response to that? We're not seeing it yet.
Uh, I'm here now. Six to six. You must get out of the lab and come rescue me. No, I did not say run around and destroy lab. Come rescue Jumba. Six to six. I see. So that's the narrative we're going with. All right, well, we're just gonna trash the lab because we can. And we have stuff to swing around with. I much prefer that to the jetpack. Be honest. You found the grapple gun. Use it to swing your way around the world. Also, just run around here and pick up DNA in the corners. Yeah, and Jumba, you had all this DNA just lying around your lab this whole time. Oh, hi. And yet you're sending me out to other freaking planets. Not the most effective way of doing things. Okay, anyways. Now then. So it seems to be kind of inconsistent about when it is and isn't easy to grapple onto. They're moving, but and you can still grapple it anyways. That looks like a pain. So I have stuff floating on the middle of nowhere too. Wonderful. I missed that. Where was that? How did I not pick up that DNA at all that whole time? Oh man, I didn't get up there. I was doing it until then. Ah! It <laughs> ran away from me. Alright. Whoa. Careful. Alright. You can't rotate as quickly as I'd like to be able to rotate. For the sake of reacting to this thing. Not letting you grab it. Darn it. That's too close that time. So this death animation is a little bit longer than it needs to be, I think. Alright. Yeah, how did I never pick that up? There we go. Okay. So I think we can get to the top of here and that'll be good. Whoa! Stitch! What? What was that? Ah! Come on! Yeah, I guess I'll get to the, the top of there and that'll be good for the episode. Come on. The only thing is, since Stitch only ever fires the gun at a certain angle, if you get too close to whatever you're trying to grapple to, he just won't grapple onto it. Okay. So, for the sake of creating suspense, I will leave what Jumbo says to us. Yeah, you gone. I'll leave what Jumbo says to us in this little transmission. Unshown until next episode, so tune in next time to see what Jumbo says here. Hey guys. Weird music, man. <laughs>